this fair play 2333 and i want to give a salute to all my cinema cronies welcome back to the power book multiverse and cinema show where you get the latest in power universe and cinema breakdown if i'm on the mission is you riding like some michelin homie in the kitchen fire stones how he whipping it i be on my michigan blue and yellow vintage it's make a right on michigan 69 too hot for us if you clicked on this video to find out about the new power spinoff i need you to hit that like button now if you're new to the channel click the subscribe button and to my cinema cronies drop the flex emoji in the comments now giovanni decided to step out sometime this week and there was a lot of people out there i guess it was for like some type of power for me i see stars on the um, marquee and stuff like that but it said what y'all think this fan base fake Final on th finale on Thursday, trust coming 2025. So I don't know if that's supposed to be the spinoff is named Power Book Trust or he's saying trust like trust something else is coming 2025. So will it be Power Book Trust? Um, and that would be a decent one. You know, everybody was thinking maybe it'll be Power Book loyalty or something like that. And then we saw Courtney Kemp win the mayor eric adams got indicted by the feds she said this would be like the storyline for power book influence so we just got to see where everything turn out now um i don't uh i've been telling y'all for a while that a new spinoff is coming it's no way that they leaving all of this open stuff and a lot of y'all y'all for y'all to be real power fans i just don't understand how y'all don't see it even when we look at the situation with power book one james st patrick we see that a lot of storylines went unanswered and a lot of things didn't get uh brought up and we got a chance to see some of that in the first season of power book two ghosts and then they just transitioned from there over to the next thing so what i would like y'all to do is i would just like y'all to understand that when i've been telling y'all it's gonna be a spinoff and when the spinoff actually come y'all gotta be like damn bro was right he said they wasn't getting rid of Tyreek. Now, this don't mean that Tyreek not going to go on a run. Um, a lot of people been expecting um, Power Book 2 Ghosts New York to link, link in with Power Book Force. Now, I think it's a possibility that the reason why they decided to not bring Force out right away is they wanted to let uh, Power breathe for a little bit. Power Book 2, let some of the ghost rumors settle down and then go over the force but if Tyreek go over the force I've been telling y'all for a while it's a strong possibility that Ghost could come back on force if y'all remember I did a video where Ghost was spotted in Chicago in Greek town and that's one of the areas that they do a lot of filming in for force so if you go to my Ghost is Alive playlist you'll definitely see that video and I'm the only well I won't say I'm the only one but I'm the first one to report on that because one of my homies from Chicago I was out of town at the time and he was in Greek town and he ended up sending me the information like, yo, I just saw all that type of stuff. You know what I'm saying? Seeing ghosts in Chicago and somebody tried to tell me, oh, ghost was in Chicago because he lived in Chicago. He from Chicago. Actually, ghost is from Georgia. If y'all don't know that. Oh, I got a great question for y'all, too. But anyway, man, I just wanted to tap in with something real quick. Y'all know I'm definitely coming back with more videos today, but I had to talk to y'all about this spinoff. I definitely think that Power Book 5 Influence is still coming. Then we got Power Origins. Um, I don't know why they didn't give that a book name because it's a part of it, but may, I thought it was supposed to be called Power Book Origins, but when I seen the thing, it looked like it just said Power Origins, which makes no sense to me, but... Oh, it do make sense because it's not a spinoff, uh, but it don't make sense really because when you look at Power Book Raising Canaan, that's an origin story too, and it's book three. But maybe they just didn't like the fact that they put the books out of order by jumping forward and back with Raising Canaan. When Power Book, I mean, Raising Canaan should have actually been his own series. It could have been, um, I don't know what it could have been, but anyway, man. Uh, before I get y'all that trivia question, 
New episode of the Barbetti family is out now. Part three. Go check that out. In this episode, somebody tries to send a strong message to the Barbetti family. And now Cordell got to go down to the west side of Chicago in order to figure out what's going on. And somebody catch a body in this episode. That's the B-A-R-B-E-T-T-I family. And it's on YouTube and Spotify now. And if you have an Instagram, follow me at F-A-I-R-P-L-A-Y underscore 2333. Now, for the trivia question, what college did Omari Hartwick go to? What sport did he play in college? And what professional did he play college sports with? I almost gave it away. Don't forget to check out my original crime drama, The Barbetti Family. The Barbetti Family is the first black Italian Chicago crime syndicate. They started in Milan, Italy in 1920 and migrated their way to the States to take over the streets of Chicago. Thanks for listening to today's breakdown of Power Book Multiverse and Cinema. If you like what you heard, don't forget to subscribe and leave a comment. For more exclusive content and photos, go to Facebook and join Power Book Multiverse and Cinema. I'm Fairplay2333. This is Power Book Multiverse and Cinema. And salute to all my cinema cronies.